Wuthering Waves is already shattering records and we see them everywhere with advertising. It is actually perfect for the upcoming release of the game. Now, if you guys want to stay up to date on the game, I got you covered. Stay subscribed and like this video to stay on this algorithm. Guys, I have to tell you, Uro Games is not playing around when it comes to this games anymore. Uh, to this game anymore. Wuthering Waves is almost here. They went all out on the advertising where they've put all types of stuff in different cities in a thing they called Waking of a World Tour. So they basically have a pretty much bus that goes around from the west coast to the east coast broadcasting live. This is so sick. We've seen them go from Los Angeles on the first stop and take some pretty rad pictures. Then we see them go to San Francisco and then we got a massive surprise with the Times Square billboard special appearance it was something to behold and I wish I somehow made it there but alas it was so cool to see all of that even from an online perspective and I'm sure this also made people talk about the game much much more which is definitely a big plus because we already reached the 30 million pre-registration milestone we also get some free pulls that is that is what every that's what's on everyone's minds now let's be on w on that we take those all day then we also saw salt lake city and i'm sure which is just like just more places that are going to be revealed shortly and we're going to see a little bit more of it while this is all happening it also showed some voice actor greetings and character post lament anthropocene or whatever they call it it's just basically an archive of information on characters i'm just really excited that they are actually putting in all the stops to make sure the success of the game's release is underway and ready to fire on all cylinders the fact that they are just i'm seeing so much commitment from them already is definitely a great step towards long-term success for this game there's a great deal to be excited for especially with now the pre-registration already met so the amount of rewards we are going to get is um already there so that is a definitely a good job for everyone watching especially you over there but yeah good job guys we did it and yeah i'm just really excited what this game is going to bring for us not just that this game is going to uh, j just going to be absolutely great i'm sure this game is going to be fantastic i'm sure this game is going to be fantastic i'm going to be covering it obviously and the thing that i'm really excited about is that this game is going to push other games to also you know keep them on their toes and you know just try to you know strive to be the best and that is what we want we already have seen a change wink wink uh it starts with a g and ends with an impact right We've already seen a change and they're going to be releasing like a new game mode or whatever or end game content for those who have been playing the game for a while now. That is definitely something good and I 100% think it is because of the upcoming release of this game, Wuthering Waves. So not only was the game making waves for themselves, it's also making a ripple effect into other games and they are definitely, you know, they're, they're, they might be panicking. They're like, okay, we gotta put in all the stops, everything that we had on the back burner, we got to bring them back and start, you know, cooking something up in the lab and putting something forth that actually matters because it's been a while. All right. This is definitely a good thing for the entire community. And I'm just I'm just very, very excited that we all get to experience this type of excitement for a game that's going to be coming out again, uh, especially me, because I'm, I love Genshin. It's a great game and I just want to see it become the best version it is. Because I, a new game almost exactly like it, just with some extra steps. I, I want to feel that feeling again. Of you know the one that I felt with Genshin Impact. As soon as that, as soon as Genshin released, it's just a different feeling. So I, I want to see if this game, you know, sort of you know makes me feel that same feeling that I had um, all the way back when, right? But yeah, anyways, I think I went into a little bit of a rant here, and it kind of got off top, off topic a little bit. But yeah. Wuthering Waves, I'm so glad that this is happening. It's happening real soon, less than 10 days now, and it is going to be awesome. I want to see you guys 
in my chat in my comment section let me know you know just letting me know what you guys are happy about excited about which characters you guys got which summons you're doing who you're pulling for i want to know everything but let me know in the comments um, i'm gonna be doing some community posts i don't know if i'll be streaming i'll i'll try maybe uh, if you guys want to watch that if not that's okay too um i'll be uploading a lot of videos i'll be covering reviews i'll be covering uh you know just characters how the game feels the end game content everything all on this channel but so i hope to see you guys back here very soon for the post release of the game yeah i'm i'm just i'm just really excited